everybody, good morning. My name is Nick Saletti and I'm an online USC student and I'm also the morning anchor at the ABC station here in Phoenix, which is why I'm up at 2.30 in the morning. This is what time I get up Monday to Friday and I don't even drink coffee, how about that? <laughs> so I'm gonna take you through my day and just show you a little bit behind the scenes of uh, what we do. All right, this is Larry, my rescue French Bulldog and he thinks it's playtime. It's always playtime with Larry, right? <laughs> hey, we gotta go for a walk. We gotta go for a walk, Larry. Come on, wanna go for a walk? Okay, so it's uh, just about 3.30, so it is time to go into work. All right, so I am here at the station right now and I'm wearing a mask because uh, we don't have many people here. Most of our people are, are working from home right now, but um, obviously we're just trying to do what we can to uh, keep each other safe. I like to come in early if I can, so that way I can go over scripts and see what's coming up in the show and also help out, see if our producers need help writing anything. This is my setup up here in the newsroom. I don't have my mask on right now because I'm about to go on camera. This is a look at my setup right now. You can see I have my lights, camera, and I also have my tablet pulled up. This is for my scripts. This is a quick look at our rundown for the six o'clock show. And it's basically, it looks like an Excel sheet and it tells us what's coming up next. And these are my fancy shoes I wear when I'm doing the news. So it's after the show and a lot of times people ask us, you know, what do you do when you're not anchoring the news? What do you do when you're not on TV? And there's actually a lot <laughs> that gets done. Uh, this morning I showed you how I was uh, just going through scripts, helping to write things, looking things up on Twitter, trying to fact check things. Obviously it's a team effort. And uh, right now I actually, I just did an interview with our former governor and we're talking about some vaccine stuff. So um, that just kind of came up out of the blue and I'm going to be going through that and putting together a story for it. So it's almost bedtime here, but before bed, I'm trying to get a little bit of reading done. This is called Getting to Yes. And it's a book I have to read for my spring class, which is employment mediation. And so far it's pretty good. It's really interesting. It talks all about negotiating and how all of us, whether we realize it or not, we're all negotiators. And Larry is sleeping on the couch. So he gets the couch, I get the floor. And I think that's pretty indicative of the power balance in this house, but it's okay. I, I wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> 